For months, prosecutors say Ghislaine Maxwell hid away in this New Hampshire mansion. But Thursday, FBI agents moved in, arriving in about a dozen cars, a plane flying above to make sure the only way she left was in handcuffs. Now Jeffrey Epstein's closest associate is sitting in a cell in this medium security county jail in New Hampshire. The 58-year-old faces four charges in connection with transporting a minor for criminal sexual activity. Maxwell has long denied any involvement with Epstein's alleged crimes. Overnight, prosecutors requested a hearing on Friday, telling the judge she's expected to be transferred to New York early this week. The question many are asking, will Maxwell reveal any secrets about others in Epstein's circle? One of his accusers, Virginia Roberts Jufrey, said this to 60 Minutes Australia. I really hope she comes forward and says, A, B, C, D, E was involved. This is how it ran. You you know, just just help us victims get some accountability. One connection of interest, Maxwell's friend, Prince Andrew. She attended Princess Beatrice's 18th birthday party, and she also visited Buckingham Palace on multiple occasions. This is not just the privilege of someone that's a casual friend. This is a very close friend. This newly surfaced photo published by the Daily Telegraph appears to show Maxwell with actor Kevin Spacey sitting on the thrones at Buckingham Palace. The Telegraph reports it was taken during a tour organized by Prince Andrew in 2002. Spacey has faced his own allegations of sexual assault, which he has denied. NBC News has not verified the photo in the palace. Spacey and Maxwell's attorney have not responded to requests for comment. Jufri says Maxwell recruited her and that she was 17 when this photo was taken in Maxwell's London townhouse next to the bathroom where she says Prince Andrew abused her. What happened? The first time in London, I was so young. Keelan woke me up in the morning and said, you're going to meet a prince today. I didn't know at that point that I was going to be trafficked to that prince. Allegations he has repeatedly denied, including in this BBC interview last year. I have no recollection of ever meeting this lady. None whatsoever. Now, a friend of Maxwell's tells Good Morning America that Maxwell was Epstein's victim, too. I believe that she is a, vic- uh, is a victim of Jeffrey Epstein, just like many other people were. It doesn't mean that um, what she did was right, but I also know that she tried many, many, many times to get away from Jeffrey, and he kept keeping her there, luring her there. Steph, uh, for months now, there has been this back and forth about Prince Andrew speaking with officials here in the United States. Do we know where that stands? You know, the U.S. attorney was asked about that on Thursday, the day they arrested Ghislaine Maxwell, and she said that they are interested in speaking to Prince Andrew. But then a person close to his team tells NBC News that they are, quote, bewildered by that comment, that they have communicated with the U.S. attorney's office twice in the last month and got no response, Craig.